Hey, yo, welcome back to another little video, man. It's going to be a little different. I kind of just want to talk to y'all for a second. And uh, hopefully this resonate with anybody that's interested in getting into the dog shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'll put in years of work, sacrifice. Um, I'm going to go to sleep. I got a uh, good moments that I, I wasn't able to attend. Um, birthdays, um, celebrations, baby showers. Um, even seeing my own kids born to provide some of the best dogs um, that the world has to offer. Like my dogs are very incredible, and I put in a lot of time. Um, a lot of research to get them now. Um, don't think you're going to buy one of my dogs. Never show the world the dog. Never show what it's like to own the dog. Breed the dog. And expect the like sell puppets like it don't work like that as y'all know when i bought my dogs i even showed what it took to get them um the day after having them it's it's a whole journey a whole journey like the ups the downs the, the good the bad the the everything like i showed everything like and i did it for years before i ever bred my dog Y'all know my dogs personally. Y'all know their names. Y'all know their characteristics. Y'all know what it's like to have them um, just by watching me. Y'all know their personality so good. Like, you know my dogs. You feel like watching my channel makes you guys feel like you own one of my dogs. That is the reason why when I breed one of my dogs, they sell really quickly. Um, because they have already watched the, the journey. People have already been paying attention to the journey. Um, it's not about the end point. It, it's all about the journey. It's all about the trials and tribulations. It's all about all that. So, like, um, I say this, say this. Nothing about what I do is easy. Like, I'm up all night, every night. I'm cleaning up poop three, four times a day. Um, sometimes right after I clean, dogs will jump, step in the pool, jump on each other. So I got to rewatch dogs. This is, it's, it's one of those things that like, that's part of it. And, um, I embrace every single part of it. Um, this, this game, this dog breeding game, I don't care if you're breeding nanos to all the way up to double XL or whatever other dog breed that you're breeding this isn't for emotional people this isn't for the weak um and not saying that people that can't handle it are weak people it just this is a different type of crazy you gotta be a little crazy to to want to to breed dogs you gotta be like a little crazy because this ain't no i'm gonna get rich doing this it's not about getting rich this is you do this, if you if you breed dogs, you have to you have to love dogs. Like you have to sleep, wake up, shit, shower. Dogs, like this have to be this have to be your life. Um, I notice people um think that they can buy a dog, never show the dog, never show what it's like to own a dog, breed the dog and sell puppies. It, it, it would never ever work like that. I know people that went and spent fifteen thousand dollars on a female, went and spent ten thousand dollars on a male. Male look amazing, the female look amazing. Um, they bred the dog, they can't sell a puppy. Um, cause everybody want to see what it was like to own the dog. You don't show what it's like to own the dog. People are not as quick to buy the dog. Puppy. Um, 
This is really important that you that everybody learn this. This ain't nothing I'm just not saying. I've been saying this forever. And not only did I say this, I've demonstrated everything that I'm mentioning. Like I've demonstrated everything that goes on with it from dogs fighting to um, having to rehome certain dogs to um, learning what dogs can be with other dogs, personalities, what personalities click, what personalities don't click. It's been a journey and I I love every bit of it. Um, I didn't get into the game trying to make a lot of money on selling dogs. Like I told y'all, I spent down to $10,000 on each one of my dogs. They're very expensive dogs. Um, and I was selling their puppies for $2,500, $1,500, hundred, $4,500, stuff like that. Um, only because it's not about trying to make my money back. I am trying to create the best XL American bully I've ever seen. I'm trying to create the best American bully I've ever seen. I'm trying to create something I haven't seen yet. I'm trying to put something together that hasn't been put together before. I'm trying to put something together that nobody's ever seen before, and I want to stamp it. Once I get it how I want it, I want to stamp it. That's why I'm selling the dollars for 15 and 25 and, and as cheap as I'm selling them for, because right now, I am more interested in branding than I am interested in getting some money right now. I am building my brand. As y'all see my shit behind me, look at it. Get a good look. Nothing before family. NBL, NBL kennel. This is all everything. This is everything to me. It don't say nothing about no money. It don't say nothing about no Elliot. Um, it's bigger than dogs. That's why I say family. You know, it's, it's bigger than a lot of stuff. It's just bigger than the cash, man. I'm not, I didn't get into the game thinking I was going to make a lot of money because I know nothing in the world work like that. If you smart, if you're really smart, you know, ain't no get rich quick thing. Ain't no turn profit quick thing. Nothing in the world works like that. Everything that's worth anything going to take a lot of time. I'm talking about going to take a lot of time. Um, so, yeah, man, I just want to tell everybody that if you're interested in doing this dog shit, first thing you need to do is love dogs. <sighs> That's the first thing you need to do. I've been drinking a little bit. Second thing you need to do is something else. Um, you need to have a job, a career. Because you're going to have to find this. Um, if you're lucky, if you're lucky, you put in the right amount of work, the dogs will pay for themselves. Every dollar I've ever made on the dogs, I didn't go shopping with it. I didn't buy no jewelry. I didn't buy a car. I didn't buy any, no dirt bike, none of that. I put it back into the dogs. What do y'all mean by putting it back into the dogs? Dog kennels, um, food, medicines, supplements. I re I put the money right back into the dogs. I don't I don't. You know what I'm saying? I don't kick it on the dog money. The dog money goes back to the dogs. I look at what they make. And of course, I pay myself. Of course, I got to pay myself because this is my business. But the dogs get paid first. The dogs always get paid first. Always. It's all about the dogs. This shit is about the dogs. This shit is about the family. Take care of the dogs. Take care of the family. Take care of the family. Take care of the dogs. Um, I love y'all. I really, I really feel like I needed to say this because it really means something to me. This is how if you don't have a love for this. Um, if you bring dogs on, on on their first heats and shit like that, and, and just whatever you're doing, if you're not doing the right thing, you will have to pay for it. Um, you will pay for you will you will pay for not doing the right thing. And um, why are you paying for it? You, you're learning. 
Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody makes mistakes. And um, you just got to learn from this. Learn from everything. Everybody needs to learn. I learned from everything I've ever done. Like, even though Hazel's on a second heat, Junior locked with Hazel. Hazel may be, may be pregnant. I may be having puppies from Hazel in a couple months. I didn't want that to happen. I didn't put the necessary things together to prevent that from happening, so I made a mistake. So with that being said, I may have puppies here that I don't want, that, I, that I'm not ready for. So with that being said, I'm not... Okay, I'll be there in a minute. Alright. Okay. Alright. taking a picture? I'm recording a video talking to the people. Ew. Say hey. See, I don't have a dress on now. You don't need no dress on. My dress is on the couch. Why are you dressed on the couch? Why do that? I'm trying to bite her. Get out of here. I'm, I'm recording a video now. I'm recording a video. Okay. Well, yeah. Um, I've had to pay for everything. So, with me having those those two dogs breeding, those puppies will not be expensive. Only because y'all haven't seen what Hazel looked like as an adult. Y'all haven't seen Junior what Junior looked like as an adult. These dogs will be amazing. But y'all haven't seen that. So I can't sell our dogs on potential. I'm selling dogs on what you guys are able to see. But like I said, give me five years. Give me 10 years. Give me my years. I'm, st I'm in year two right now. Hey, my puppies will be three this year. Zeus uh, and Roxy turned three this year. Chloe turned three last month or this month. Hey, um, so are we at, we at year three with with, with the dolls, y'all. Hey, my nails. Paint your nails. Mm -hmm. Okay. What? Okay. Paint it. Not painting right now. Why? How's your mama to paint your nails? You got mama for that. I'm gonna paint her feet. Yeah. Where you going? I'm crazy. Get off me. I'm, I'm... Get off me. I can't. Why you can't get off me? Get off me. Get off me. Okay. My hand right here. Get off. Get off. Why you that? It's my baby, y'all. All right. Take that plate in the kitchen for me. Thank you. you ask mama for some cake. Did mama say you can have some cake? I'm in the room. Okay. Yeah, man. Um, and mine's my pizza. Okay. Yeah, man. Whatever you do in this world, man. Um, learn from it. Grow from it. Get better. And uh, we're going to continue to move forward. NBF, I love y'all. If you ever bought a dog from me, I love you. I appreciate you. You got any advice, you know you can hit me up at 206-499-0422. Um, this shit not easy. I just make it look good. Okay? Love y'all.